tonight. Just get out there and enjoy it. Some folks might think it's a little cool with temperatures in the lower 60s by around 8 o'clock. It's going to be clear. The wind will be light at 5 to 10. Very refreshing. But also enjoy those comfortable dew points because by tomorrow afternoon, jumps back into the upper 60s, which is humid. And then Saturday, Sunday, Monday, the entire holiday weekend, and in fact, all of next week, we stay in the tropical humidity for the start of September. It is going to be uncomfortable. So once again, enjoy the lower dew points for tonight. That'll help us drop back into the mid to upper 50s, even a 60 down towards Racine. A great start to the day. The humidity does hurt to increase. And with that, another storm system coming in. You got it. Flash flood watch once again for our northern counties for late tomorrow night into Saturday evening as we're going to be tracking more heavy downpours and with the ground already saturated. Uh, it's not going to take very much in the way of rain midday tomorrow. It looks fine tomorrow evening. It looks fine for those heading out to Camp Randall for the game. It's after midnight when you get these downpours rolling on through that could create at least an inch of rain in some locations. Another front will push through here, but we're going to stay humid through the weekend. This is the long range projection. By the time we get through the holiday weekend, most of us could pick up another one to two inches of rain, maybe isolated more if you're in some of those downpours. Not expecting six to 12 inches of rain like we had a couple days ago, but more downpours on the way for tomorrow. Partly cloudy temperatures in the mid 70s and it does become more humid. Your seven day forecast shows 82 and muggy with scattered thunderstorms on Saturday, not a washout, a better chance of rain now on Sunday and Monday with temperatures in the lower 80s and it will be muggy and rainy for the next seven days.